So I'm a pretty big fan of the high grade Wing Zero, a fan of the Wing Zero in general. Once again, Wing was my first introduction to Gundam that I knew, knowing it was Gundam. But uh, you know, I never thought to myself, hey, what would, since this came out in the 90s, like the, the Mobile Zoo, what would it look like if it was made in North America? And I think we have that answer with the Wing Zero Sky. Since it's very, it's very 90s. It's very, uh, if you were in a, into Transformers or into Transformers, it's very Generation 2 with the kind of bright, weird palette that you wouldn't expect to go together. But surprisingly enough, this works. I might, might be a fan of the sky more than the normal Wing Zero just for how weird the colors are. Uh, the fact that the inner frame is blue, that's definitely unique. Not a big fan of these stickers here in the, uh, the, sh the uh, backpack boosters. Not a huge deal. And that color blue does carry on to the uh, Buster Rifles, which you can peg together to make the twin Buster Rifle. Just gotta flip in one of the handles. And I, I do, I always appreciate when you can just slide a gun into a hand without having to remove the hand cover. We also got the shield with the same kind of colors. This black, I don't know why it works, but it really does with the rest of the color. You got the old Extendomatic to uh, drag across the building just for the fun of it. it. Does have metallic stickers and the black ring. I like the fact that the uh, handle does kind of collapse into the uh, shield. And it's uh, it's solid enough once you have it picked in there. Now the Wing Zero High Grade, since this is simply a recolor, it shares the uh, flaws that the original had, which is really only two that I well, no three. Uh, first, beam saber. You got a nice little beam saber. You got two, and you do have two clear green because the '90s was clear green time. Although this one does not like to hold. Uh, the other one's fine. But that's not my problem, because beams can do that. It's the fact that they made this part open up. I, if I remember the show, it's been a while. It's supposed to pop up and out so that the Wing Zero can use it, but uh, can't store it. Now, that would have made the shoulders bigger, which would have ruined the design. So I don't know how to feel, because I would have liked to have that feature, but also these shoulders would be rather bulky. So, eh. Also... Uh, the fact that when transforming it, you have to switch out the feet. <laughs> so you have to bring in these ones, which are transformed. And I don't understand why, because it, I, as far as I know, it's simply rotating the feet up like that, and then flipping the heel to reveal the thruster. Maybe they could do it nowadays, I have no idea. But you have to actually take out the thruster and replace it into the uh, new photo. So that's another thing. And then the third thing... The uh, machine guns on the chest. Like you, you open the panel and it, they're nicely detailed. Let's see if I can show them. They're there, but as far as I can tell, even in the instructions, there's nowhere to like rest this. You can kind of have it like that, but and again, I don't think you saw that. But there's just nowhere to there's nowhere to stick this. I thought maybe they would have like had a hole in the backpack right there, so you kind of tab it in. No, I guess they're just supposed to pull them off and leave them off. Kind of annoying once again, another piece you have to take off and possibly lose. It, it can happen. But of course we have the uh, transformation. And depending on how fast I am doing this, I might uh, just fast forward to that. It's not, it's not a super uh, duper complicated transformation. But it can be... A little time assuming. At least they were able to keep those parts. The actual legs flipping out. So that you can uh, grab the the new feet and peg them in. I'm just gonna I'm gonna, I'm gonna do one. I'm just gonna do one. Just showing you that that's the way they want it, but is that I mean would you wanna go through all the trouble of doing that or just that? Picky poison. I think I would, I would be okay. It's a nice little detail, but if I have to, I'd probably just leave it. 
and you got the old shield, which for the longest time, I didn't realize these were Vulcans in the shield. I have no idea why I didn't figure that out. Because they're obviously something, but I just don't really pay that much attention. And then you can just tab those buster rifles into the nose cone for something to do. And you do have a pretty sweet Neo Bird mode. I do like it. So, yeah, I would I would transform the other foot, but or sorry, really parts form. Uh, but I I don't know where it is, and I really don't care because I'm not gonna. After this video, I'm not gonna do it again. If I did, it'd be like that. It's just easier. Just gotta say it's easier. So it is cool. I, I do like it. I'm not gonna keep it like that. Uh, there is a hole here for an action base in the uh, butthole. So it is anatomically correct. It's got two holes. That's good. Now what I'm hoping <laughs> is because we got the the Wing Zero high grade, and it's good, but like I said, it has a few issues which I'd like them to fix, and I think they could do it if they do what they did with the Wing Gundam and give us a real grade. I wasn't expecting this uh, when it was announced, and now I finally have it, and it's amazing. I think it needs to be done. We need a real grade Wing Zero Bandai. Not the EW, we have the EW, and we have the, uh, uh, the normal Wing Gundam EW and the Wing Zero EW. We need the normal one. It, it, it's time. It's time. Come on. Come on. Do it. Please. And also then recolor like that. 